find my inspiration in nature primarily. I just love the way the Van Gogh color just spreads across the canvas. I've been using the Van Gogh for well over 20 years now and I'm creating an abstract. I love to just see how it comes alive, how it makes itself reveal itself before my very eyes. It's beautiful. Um, I can create a story just by putting some linseed embedded with pigments. And I love working with the palette knives. In a lot of my other work I, I use a lot of brushes, work in that semi-realistic state. But when I look at an abstract, or when I'm working on an abstract, I kind of feel free. It's very freeing, I guess, and very beautiful thing because of the lack of rules that I would have. I don't have to worry about whether I am making a mistake or if I'm putting on too much color because in the end it really doesn't matter because I'm just trying to tell a story with the color and the placement of the color. One of the most enjoyable parts about being an artist is to be able to inspire people. Inspire people to look at art, but more importantly, inspire people to try art. You don't need to always show your work in big galleries or big shows. A lot of it is just if you can create something to hang in your, to hang in your own home, something that you accomplish, that's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful thing. This is one of my favorite times during a painting like this when it really kind of all starts to come together. Colors start creating shape. Not quite sure exactly where I'm still going to go with it yet, but I've got a pretty good look. And at this point in time, I'm like super excited about the whole painting. It's really kind of creating itself. Um, a couple hours in the studio, I can create something that never was there before. And it's beautiful. It's a beautiful thing, you know, to see something that's really coming together is really amazing. And I thank Van Gogh for all of that. Van Gogh brand.